This is Casey Krejci with Living Fuel TV. Today, special guest, Dave Herman. Hug Dave. it out, hug it out, Casey. Good to see you, brother. All right. <laughs> Glad to have you. Thanks, man. As you've seen on our show, that we bring you the top guys, and Dave is definitely one of those guys, an elite trainer. You know, these are the people who the, the famous people come to to get trained, the, the world-class athletes and so on. So, Dave, there's something different about you. I know the things that are different about you. You, are, you really are passionate about what you do. You're very excited, and you come up with new ways to accomplish things, uh, to, to give people more flexibility, range of motion, enhanced strength in a very you know, powerful concept. We call you the band man, the band guy. Dave uses resistance bands in a way that, that I've not seen anybody else do it. I mean, this is really a passion of yours. How did, how did, you, how did you arrive at bands being the, the primary? Well, what had happened was I began training a, actually a, a, an Olympic swimmer who had retired and he was now going to try the professional golf tour. And I began training him, and we were working out a lot, doing a lot of stuff in the weight room, a lot of strength training. And he says, Dave, you know, we're just doing more strength endurance work. We're not doing, we're not doing this explosive stuff that, that you need to be doing. And, I, and he made me think about it, and I thought about it. How, how do you go after explosive fast twitch fiber? And I started looking at different ways to do it, and there's a couple of ways. You can do it with heavy weights, or you can do it with bands. And I came across this, uh, this band expert at the Super Show who showed me, kind of taught me, he was a guru, taught me how to use these large rubber bands for flexibility, for speed, for strength, for stability, and especially to be able to go after that fast twitch fiber in a, in a, in a safe and effective way. So explosiveness, explosiveness is really the missing ingredient in a lot of people's uh, yes. training. Yes. And so, also the key ingredient in a lot of sports. Abs every sport. First step Almost speed every sport, yes. is huge. Yes, other in than fact, a distance running. <laughs> well, actually, I had, a, uh, I had a pro football player tell me this week, he says, we're all the same speed, we just don't all start as fast as the other. So, so it's interesting, he says that the, the first three steps of the 40 is where you make the difference in a, in a low four time and a, and a high four time. Same with baseball, steal in second. That's how I got started. It was, uh, was implementing the bands into my training program because in the past I've done a lot of medicine ball work, uh, a, lot of, uh, cardi a lot of cardiovascular work, a lot of different running, bikes, all types of uh, UBEs, upper body pieces, a lot of different strength work, weights, cables, pulleys, everything, in integrating everything. So the bands came in and just brought everything together for me. Well, a lot of the sports you deal with, well, primarily your golf. Golf. Tennis, golf and tennis, yes. Is my tennis is where you started. Yes. But golf is the primary or are you about, about even? Golf is primary now. Oh. Being, being based out of Orlando, growing up in Tampa, which is close to where we are now, was, is more of a tennis city, whereas Orlando is more of a golf city. So interestingly, the bands, as, as I've done them with you, you know, it's obvious that you, know, you do the motion with a band, and then when you take the band away, it's really a very fluid motion, and I guess that really is kind of the whole... Well, you can, uh, you can strengthen in specific manners, in specific moves. So you can strengthen uh, in different planes of motion, things that you can't do with, with, with weights. You know, you can, like we were talking about earlier, you can mimic a, a, a throwing motion. You know, you can mimic a forehand in tennis. You can, uh, you, you can do core, uh, core rotation things. And, and the, well, the nice thing about bands is that you can fire into the bands to create and hit that fast twitch fiber. Which is the explosiveness, explosiveness. that we're all looking for. Yeah. Very powerful Absolutely. stuff. So, so what else is key in that area with the bands? What, what else would you see is? Well, I like that there's some interesting things that you can do. The flexibility is great. You know, getting the, the, the muscles more loose, the joints, a lot of distraction sort of techniques that you can go out in there and, and, and really uh, work those proprioceptors in the joints, clearing up joint space, uh, decompressing joints. It's just, it's amazing what you can do with them. Any athletes that you're working with currently, uh, it's okay to mention their names? Because I know several that they're, it's not okay to mention their names, but is there anybody you're working with that uh, is okay with it? Yeah, I mean, right now, uh, full-time, I'm with Suzanne Peterson on the LPGA, Trevor Immelman on the PGA, 2008 Masters champ, respectively. And, uh, you know, we have a, a, a whole bunch of young athletes coming up through the program now. Terrific, terrific. I really have a passion for working with kids. And the bands go so well with kids in their program because a lot of times, we, you know, I don't do weights with kids before they're 13 years, before they're 13 years old. I don't want to do any damage to the growth plates, any damage to the to the discs. I want everything to kind of 
be where it needs to be before I put bring in those weights. I remember last year you had great success with a, a top European young golfer over a short period of time. The difference in just the look was, was pretty phenomenal. Yeah, you can move fast, yeah, if you do it the right way. Terrific. Well, we're going to get into a lot of the specifics of this, but we wanted to introduce you to the people, and so it's really exciting to have you. Yeah, man. Thanks for coming. Thanks. Well, I sure hope you enjoyed it, and we look forward to future, uh, future shows. God bless you, and have a great day.